Hey, what's up? This is DTJ here. Like and subscribe for more videos for living and visiting in Japan. So today we're going to go over what to do when you miss a package. Missing a delivery sucks for everyone involved, right? For you and for the driver especially. But it's a part of online e-commerce. So you have to know what to do when you order something online and it arrives when you aren't home. Kudo Neko is the largest parcel delivery company in Japan. Your package will likely be delivered by them or the JP post office. This is a missed package notification slip that was on my doorstep one day. You'll find it in your mailbox, on your door, window, somewhere you won't miss it. If you get this, don't panic, but instead do this. So the number at the top is for the actual driver. If you are confident in your Japanese speaking abilities, then you can call him or her directly to tell them that you're home and you're ready for the package. However, they're likely to be driving and might not pick up. So then option two would be to arrange a delivery date for your missed package. You could do all this by calling either of the two numbers. However, the first number should be called from a house phone and the second from a cell phone. So let's hear what it actually sounds like when you call. So the action for your Denpyo Bango and the 12 digit number for your package. It's randomly generated and so it's never the same. It's unique to each package. Once you enter that, you will have the option of scheduling a date. I advise you to check out my video on how to tell time and how to send the dates in Japanese by clicking the card above. So after you selected a date, you can actually select the time by entering zero for any time, one for the morning, two for two to four p.m., three for four to six p.m., you can hit the four button for six to eight p.m. or hit the five button for time seven to nine p.m. Then you're all set to sit back and wait for your package to arrive. Try not to miss it this time. And like I said, it's good to know how to say each unit of time in Japanese for situations such as this. So be sure to check out that video on how to tell time in Japanese. It's a full guide, it goes over everything from how to say seconds. Uh, all the way to decades in Japanese. So enjoy your delivered package. I'm DTJ. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. See you on the next one. DTL.